Ade, how was your day? Hi Chris, hi Nia. Look at this. What is that? It is an uphill down experiment video. This is weird, isn't it? It's so weird. Yeah, it looks like breaking the law of physics. It felt illegal. It must be an edited video, right? I don't know. The video doesn't profit anything more than this. Can you imagine? Neoton watching this from the afterlife? He might start his but help and wonder to rewrite the law of gravitation. <laughs> <laughs> That's not how it works. Did you know? Yes, of course, because I have seen it in post by fact. The object looks like it's moving upward, right? But actually, the object is moving downward. Why? Because the object uh, is still being put by Earth gravity. However, because our visual is from the side, so the object looks like it's moving upward. Evidence down below. The center of mass is initially at the top, but decreased downward. Contact point of mass which start at the bottom of the cone, become increasingly wider towards the center of mass. Things that influence why this can happen. First, the shape of the object cone with the center of mass at the tip and then form a pipet track from bottom to top. This makes the object appear to be rolling upwards. Aww. Yeah, and by the way, this experiment is a great way to learn about the law of physics, especially the law of gravity. Hmm. I see. This is just an illusion, but the real one is the coin still downwards by the gravity. Right. Now Tom must be rubbing his butt head with a smile, right? So, <laughs> yeah, so sometimes uh, the world can be stronger than we imagine. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Attention everyone, we are set to embark on our group today. Please gather promptly in the lobby as we sound the meeting together and please make sure not to be late. Okay. okay. Hey, what did the lecture just teach? It's just about the chance to rest and experience. Then explain it to me, brother. Sure, I have a video about it. I'll send you now. Oh. What's that? And I'll explain then. Okay. This exhibit show Newton's second law of motion. We will see how the balls reach the bottom of the different tracks at different times. Do you think which ball is the fastest? The first ball, second ball, or the third ball? Ball number one is the fastest, right? I am on number three. I agree with Adha. I'm sure ball number three will arrive first. Huh. Let's see the video first. See, the third ball was the fastest. It's because ball number 3 will first reaches the end of the track is the ball in the track designed to give drastically heat change therefore more acceleration. Meanwhile, the straight track gives small acceleration and the wavy track gives positive negative acceleration alternately. This slows its movement. Men always be men. Come on guys. Where are we going? The key fund. <laughs>